Hey there, Haru here, and today we are doing something slightly different. Uh, I haven't done this before, but we can finally open our vault as a guardian druid slash feral, since we're done with Prague now. Uh, but yeah, let's just take a look and see what we have available. Uh, I I think we have a two slot from Mythic Raid and the three slots from Mythic Plus. But because Raid Trinkets are pretty much bis, we're gonna be opening our uh, we're gonna be opening up our vault as either Guardian or Feral, depending on how many trinkets are available. So let me just really quickly go through all the bosses and count up the trinkets as both uh, Feral and Guardian. Two... Three... Four... And five, six as Guardian. For Feral, we got what? One... Two... Three... Four... Five and six. So it's six and six. But the trinkets I think I want are obviously going to be Beacon. I want to say this ward of Face of Sire could also be very useful. The problem though is I actually have not killed the Echo of Notharian on Mythic. So if I did get this, it would be from my one heroic slot. Hmm. Dragonfire Bomb Dispenser would be decent on Tyran Mix. Let me see. What's the how long does it take for this to, to to like activate? Dealing 50k damage after seven seconds. Uh I think this would only be good on Vortex Pinnacle on the last boss. I was thinking, you know, if this could help with uh, the Brackenhide last boss on the totems, it would have a lot more value. Obviously got the Ominous, and then we have the Pocket Anvil. This is something I maybe run on Tyran Weeks. Most likely not though, if I had Beacon and Ominous. So I think that's kind of out of the question. So I think... Guardian is probably going to be the play for me. Because I don't I don't think I really want this. I think this is the only trinket um, as feral that I cannot get as tank. So I don't really mind too much if I don't get this. Giving her mangle, maul, and shred to deal 25k additional shadow flame damage on hit. Uh, I don't know. Th this could be useful against the uh, against Brackenhide last boss, but uh, I I don't think I would ever replace this, or I don't think I would ever replace my beacon to use this on that boss. I would probably replace the Ominous Chromatic. Eh. Alright. We are going Guardian. It has been decided. Pray to the RNG. Ooh. Okay, so we did get a Mythic Ominous. And this can be upgraded to 447. In 1-5. Ooh. Socketed wrist. Huh. I don't think this is the play. Because I'm bound to get some kind of shit 
weak. Also, I haven't defeated seven bosses? Really? I swear I did two heroic bosses on my druid. I guess not. I don't think I take these risks. Even though they have a sock. Because I'm I'm gonna get a shit week where I have to take a sock instead. 447 shoulders. Probably gonna get the raid ones instead, which will be higher eye level. So I don't think I take these either. The gloves and they have leech. Ooh. But this is also th something I can hold off on a bit because I already have mythic gloves and it can be upgraded to 447. Um, I think the chromatic essence wins here. If I want to like kind of future proof my gear. Because the uh, raid shoulders, let's see, mm, yeah, the raid shoulders are going to be like 450, so there's no point in even taking this. Gloves do have leech, but leech is like nerfed. I think you would rather have avoidance now. Yeah, I think, I think Ominous Chromatic Essence probably wins that then. Alright, not too bad. Can't complain too much. Not a big upgrade, but it will have a, a bit more value in 1.5. Not too shabby. Nice, and I don't even have to swap out my uh, resonance. Alright, hope you guys enjoyed. I uh, might do this a bit more in the future, depending on, you know, uh... Other people are actually interested in it. I may start doing this for Boomy at the start of tiers. I don't I don't know how many Boomy players also play Guardian or whether you guys are even interested, but I'll try and uh, do that too. See you guys in the next one. Um.